So welcome back everybody. My name is Andrew and you're watching the Kelly's Country Life. This is your first time visiting the channel. Thank you for stopping by. If you like the content, hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. So I just had some stuff come in the mail. By the way, not a sponsored video. Bought all this with my own money. But I wanted to share something with y'all. I was kind of surprised by the savings. So we've been running a home security system for years. We've actually been using Simply Safe because, well, they work off of cellular. And we lived in a camper for quite a while and we wanted to keep an eye on our shop and on our camper itself so a cellular system made sense and we've decided just to stick with it since we get monthly monitoring as well so today i am actually going to secure the house up a little more we're going to put some door sensors on some motion sensors we already have security cameras everywhere by the way our simply safe system has its own security camera we also run wi-fi cameras on the house and i run cellular cameras outside so no matter what in the event that somebody say maybe hacks your internet i'm still covered i have cameras that work off cellular you lose power i'm still covered i have wi-fi cameras that work off of cellular i'm actually going to put a battery backup system on my wi-fi router then again you still have battery backup and solar powered cellular cameras as well so multiple different ways to keep an eye on the place no matter what the condition so we just got moved into the house and i signed up for homeowners insurance and one of the first questions they asked me do you have any sort of monitoring burglary monitoring yes actually we do then i was asked what about fire monitoring i said i can get that very quickly so i ordered in a fire monitor for our Simply Safe system. Now here's the crazy part. I just went and pulled up my homeowner's insurance policy. They gave me $150 discount on my yearly policy just for adding, I think this was a $29 smoke detector. And now my official Simply Safe form says, hey, you have fire monitoring on your home. I forget what the discount was for having a burglary system or a monitored security system. So think about that. I got $150 off a year from here on out for buying a $30 smoke alarm. It doesn't cost any extra monitoring month for me to add the fire monitoring to this. It was an absolute no brainer. So make sure you check with your insurance policy. If you have a monitored security system and if you have fire monitoring, you need to call and get your discount. So they offer all different kinds of monitors. Again, motion, glass break sensors, door and window sensors, fire, water sensors, they have just about everything under the sun. And I'm gonna to continue to add and kind of cater this system to what we need for the home. So that's how we're gonna kick this episode off. Let's start installing some of this stuff, testing it out, making sure that we're monitored and safe. And then we'll move on to something else in this episode. All right, so something else I want to tackle in this episode is finishing up this bathroom. As you can see, I still have to caulk and seal in this joint here, paint the wall, got a lot of touch-up painting to do, some remaining trim on the floor, and I finally got some handles in for these custom cabinets that I built here. I'll include a link down in the description in the video if you want to watch how I built these laundry pullouts. 
Plus, I told a lot of y'all I would show them off once we started using them, and we've been using them for a while now. They've been working great. We're just having to grab a hold of them and pull them out because I did not have the style handles that I wanted. So let's install these real quick. I'll show you how we have this loaded up. All right, well that was simple enough, and if you are new to the channel and have not seen, we had wasted dead space here. Instead of making the shower even bigger than we needed it to be, we left the dead space, and I had to always envision building some pull-out laundry closets here, and we just got that done. So if you'll look, we have a tremendous amount of room down here now. Actually, more room than we know what to do with. So if you take a look in here, we can store a tremendous amount of toilet paper, we have a full shelf just for washcloths, and we're a little low on towels right now. Uh, Tiffany's doing a load, but we roll up and just put a bunch of white towels in there, and you can stack them several high and get 12 to 15 towels per shelf. We can put some spares up here, even more toilet paper, uh, soap, shampoos, whatever you want. We are not even utilizing the top shelf, and we could still rearrange this stuff and use a lot more space. So this has been working out very, very well. All right, well, this was another good little punch list episode. What you didn't see off camera is I did a ton of touch-up painting. Anytime I pull out a certain color paint, like white, for example, I just painted the trim, or this beige painting here, I'll go around the house, start doing some touch-up painting. So really the last major touch-up painting is all the green and then some stuff outside and the exterior doors themselves. So the bathroom is completely trimmed out all the way behind the door. I also put a magnetic door catch in here to always hold this open for the room. Just put a little piece of trim down for the shower. What else do we knock out in this episode? We got smoke detectors in, security systems. Hopefully you enjoyed that little tip there. Uh, there's some pretty considerable savings for smoke monitoring, burglar alarm monitoring. I think I even got a savings for putting fiber cement siding on my house. So make for sure that you call your insurance company and ask them if there are any discounts available because chances are you may be missing out on some money. There's some things that you probably already done to your house and didn't even realize it gets you good qualifications for discounts. So we've got a lot of stuff coming up on the channel. We're about to get back into some more major projects along with some little projects. I have stuff all 
over the place coming, some exciting stuff, some new and fresh stuff for the channel as well. Thank y'all so much for watching. We'll catch you on the next video.